All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. It's that time of year again. We are playing Hell Town Revival. It's gonna be spooky. Let's get let's get right to it. You know. Yes, you will do just fine. What the fuck? Hey, where are you going? Where are you going? What an awful thing, I just wanted to stop. What the hell? What am I supposed to do? Holy fuck. <laughs> that fucking scared the shit out of me. I could have done without a nightmare to start off the week. Maybe it's the stress. Got a whole new assignment after all. Better get this day started then. Okay. A letter concerning my new assignment. Dear Mr. Doe. As a cherished member of our family, the St. Marion Postal Service is happy to offer you an exciting opportunity. You've been selected to expand our services into a new housing development called Little Yale. Please report to the main office on June 12, 1959, where the more details will be sheared. Oh, it's nice outside. Really hot. Can't complain. Look how beautiful it is. Here we go. Is that me? So this is Little Vale. Talk about a scenic view. I was told there weren't civic numbers yet, so I'll have to find the address by name. Shouldn't be too hard in such a small community, but first, I should meet the head of the local post office. Let's see if there's anything I should collect. Welcome to Little Vale. I don't think there's anything out of the ordinary here. It's a nice little town. Hello there, buddy. You must be the delivery guy I was told about. Welcome to Little Vale. You'll find life here is much less busy than in San Marino. So much so, in fact, that we just have one single package to send. Get it straight from the delivery box and bring it back to the truck. There's just one package in the delivery box that looks like a bunch of documents. I had to drop it off at my truck and start delivering the packages I brought. Okay. Nobody is really moved from their place. Oh. Okay. In you go. Now the first package is addressed to Ra Rachel. It's got a real nice smell to it. Rachel. Are you Rachel? Oh yeah, my exotic herbs finally arrived. They'll be perfect for the special tea I like to make, thank you. Hey, you're welcome. I assume this is the church, right? Okay. Um... Son, I see you've brought me my parcel. Many thanks. These old torn what old tomes? Tomes? We're hard to come by, so I'm relieved to see them intact after such a long journey. One more package and it's addressed to Patrice. There seems to be a ton of stuff inside. Alright, let's find Patrice. 
Maybe it's general store? Doors are doors are locked. Seems to be a bunch of shelves inside. Oh, you're Patrice? Oh, okay. If it's no bother, would you mind taking these brushes and paints to Jim? You should be by the river near the bridge in a small clearing. Can't miss them. Uh, sure. I don't know where the bridge is, but... Maybe it's all the way back here. I don't know. Is that him? What the fuck is this? You Jim? These are just what I needed to finish my creation. Thanks, mister. It's not quite finished yet. Yeah. It's kind of, uh... It's kind of weird, but, you know, looks all right. Looks all right. Well, I guess that's it. Better get out of here. Rotten luck, my truck worked perfectly fine just a few hours ago. Might need to rent a room at the hotel for the night and get the truck towed tomorrow morning. Rough. Now I'm trapped in this creepy little village. Surely there's nothing wrong. It's probably okay. Hello. One room for the night? Please head to the elevator. Your room number is 119. I guess I get in for free. Looks like I'm not the only outsider here after all. My name's Neil, I'm a reporter for the Rockies Inquirer. I've been following leads on some strange stuff happening here, like real strange. You dig? <laughs> Don't know how long you plan on staying in Little Vale, but I'd make it quick if I were you. Okay. Everything seems pretty nice though. I guess I'm sleeping here. Could use some shut eye. Hopefully everything will be all right tomorrow. Hmm. Did I hear shouts or was I dreaming? Fucking god. What the fuck? <laughs> that? The nun? What is this? Can't make heads or tails of the writings on this paper. Uh, okay. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Yo! Okay. You got me a little bit. Not too much, but you got me a little bit. I don't think I've been down here before. Oh. Uh. Okay. Oh my god. I apologize if we woke you up. Don't worry, I'll be all yours very soon, but for now, let's put you back to sleep. Whoa, 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 holy shit. Yo, what the fuck? Get the fuck out of here! Get the fuck out of here! Oh. Okay, that was weird. And he wakes up outside of his hotel. That was weird. I was dreaming. It's already morning. I don't even remember waking up. These nightmares are getting worse. Yep. Yeah, time to check out. Time to leave. Oh. 
Oh, come on, man. Come on, man. What the fuck is going on here? Oh, Jesus. Morning, my son. I'm aware that your vehicle has malfunctioned, and we've taken the liberty of calling a tow truck for you. It should be back tomorrow. In the meantime, if it's no bother, I have a request to ask of you. We have a very important event scheduled for tonight, and we desperately need help with the matter in particular. I'll be internally grateful if you could visit George at the post office and help us. Well, why the fuck would I do that? Oh, it's foggy. Uh, George, right? Glad to see you. Came out to help, didn't you? Everybody in town needs to receive their customized bouquet before tonight's event. I have a lot of things to take care of, and there are still three undelivered bouquets here. You'll know who's who. The colors are unique to each bouquet. Alright. Black roses in the center. How would I know who's who? That, what? Why would I know that? Maybe you? Okay, yeah. There's my bouquet. I'm excited for tonight. Not a lot of people manage to earn three black roses. It's something to be proud of. Uh, okay. Don't see anything red here. Maybe it's this lady right here. Oh, okay. My bouquet has four black roses. Some of the folks here didn't even manage to get one. Like, grow a pair. Tonight's the night. It's gonna be a blast. What? What's, what's happening tonight? I don't get it. I don't really see anybody else here. Maybe it's you. Oh, the bouquet. I didn't know I was giving them to guys, too. I couldn't bring myself to earn the black rose. I, I just... Ne never mind. Okay. Well, he's, he's happy. I'm be stock. Single black rose in the center. That's this lady up here. She's bitching about it. Pretty sure. No? You? Maybe it's you. Thank you. My first black rose. It wasn't easy, but I believe it'll be all worth it. Alright. Fucking weirdo ass town. Well, it looks like that's the last of them. Hey, you know the owner of the general store, Patrice? You're supposed to bring me packaging supplies today. I wonder what's the holdup. Would you mind checking up on him for me? He should be somewhere in his store. What am I? Just like everyone's errand boy now? What's up with that? Chuck shit around. Oh. Oh, that's not good. I'm gonna be sick, oh god. What the fuck? A list of everybody in town? There are notes beside each of their names. Bruce. Woman picked up on the highway. Nancy, blood. Blonde hitchhiker on the highway. Nancy. Three black roses. I need to get out of here. Oh, fuck, man. Yeah, let's get the fuck out of here. Oh! Oh, you just knocked me the fuck out. Ceremonial night. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. This isn't good. They locked me in. I hit keys around the park leave before it's too late. What the fuck is this thing? Ah! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Jesus Christ.
Christ. It's really weird. Oh, what's this? Oh my god! No, we need to go. Ah, there we go. We got it. We got it. Oh. What? The fuck? Oh no. Someone's burning alive over there. This can't be happening. I need to get out of here. Uh. Take my chances running back home. I mean, yeah, I probably would. Oh shit, there's fucking demons there. What the fuck are those things? Let's get the fuck out of here, dude. Oh my god, yo, that fucking scared me. Run. Zoink, Scoob. Oh man, this is not good. Oh, this isn't gonna get me home. <laughs> it's crazy. Other world, oh my god. It's about to get a whole lot of work. Yep, I ain't getting, I ain't going anywhere. I'm fucking stuck here. What the fuck? You lost him? My instructions were clear. Keep him alive and locked up. I cannot afford to babysit you any longer. The ritual has begun. I must have him. Before dawn, find him. I'm right here! What the fuck happened to him? This town got fucked up. There's little things crawling around. What am I supposed to do? Can't, uh... Jesus Christ! Totally unnecessary. Totally unnecessary! Holy fuck. Alright. Okay, we need to get like a round. that big dude go oh my god he was right there oh shit that fucking scared me oh is that the town oh that's kind of cool oh it's an upside down cross dude that's crazy all right we're going into alien ship Oh, Jesus. This is terrible. What the fuck is that? Is that big boy again? Uh, 
What the fuck? Trust it, do not look away. It's that fucking weird ass statue, huh? I should take this. Oh, fuck, it just looked at me. Fucking terrified right now. Still hear that fucking thing walking around. This human must listen to us. Only it can stop the human witch's ritual. Not a lot of time. In her graveyard, she holds three effigies of power that you must destroy. That's easy work, buddy. What's this thing again? It's the furnace from my dream. I need to find Lilith's effigies and burn them. complete waste and to think I had chosen you. You only delayed the inevitable. I'll find others to sacrifice and begin the ritual all over. Your efforts were in vain, I'm afraid. I'll take great pleasure in ripping you apart. So I die. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, that just to get my head snapped. Wow, that was it. Helltown Revival, everybody. That was crazy. I'm out. Like and subscribe. Peace.